All right, hey guys, welcome back to another video. This video, I'm going to be reviewing Mario vs. Donkey Kong for the Nintendo Switch. Um, this game came out maybe like a week ago, two weeks ago. I'm not sure. But yeah, that is the front of it. It has the back. All right, so Mario vs. Donkey Kong. This is basically a... Uh, um, a remake of the original game that came out back in 2004 for the Game Boy Advance. Um, I never really played that version. I think I only played like the first stage and then I was done with it. Because um, truth be told, puzzle games is not really my kind of games to play. Um, but uh, yeah, the way I was able to play the original one was through the Nintendo 3DS uh, when they had the ambassador program um, for the people that um, bought the 3DS um, like when it first came out Nintendo was they charged like uh, I forgot how much the system costs but I remember it being like 300 and something dollars and then it wasn't selling that well so then Nintendo did a huge price drop on it and then for the people that bought the console you know around the time when it came out they had gave us 10 free games and Mario vs. Donkey Kong was one of them. So that's how I tried out the game. <clears throat> Didn't really get into it. It wasn't really my kind of thing. So when they announced this remake, you know, I got excited because, you know, better graphics and stuff like that. And, you know, I tried it out. <clears throat> tried the demo out that they had. And I enjoyed it. It was enough for me to buy the full game and give it another try. And I actually did enjoy this game. It's a bit short. It's a bit on the easy side. But it's a good game. It was a good game. Uh, so what is Mario vs. Donkey Kong? Basically, Mario vs. Donkey Kong is a, um, is a 2D um, platforming puzzle game. Um, story goes, um, Donkey Kong, he's in his home and he's chilling. He's watching TV. So he sees and... Um, like an advertising for um, the Mario toys. Um, you know, Mario has his own toy company, so Donkey Kong sees that they he's bringing out these new toys, and so he gets excited. You know, he you know falls in love with the toys, and he runs to the toy company and tries to steal everything. So Mario, you have to stop him from you know taking all these toys. So you go through various levels in the game where you have to find gifts, you have to find a key to get to the next part of the stage. Um, that's for the like the, the, the first part of the game. That's um that's each level for the first part of the game. There's three gifts you have to find on each level. If you find all of them with the key, you get a hundred percent, you get the um you rescue the toy. <clears throat> and then um the last stage is where you have to put all the toys in the box. I think there's six toys in total. For each um, world that you put in the box. And after that, there's a boss battle with Donkey Kong. So you have to do that for each world. Um, pretty fun. Um, the boss battles are pretty easy. <coughs> but um, yeah, it's a, it's, a, uh, it's a puzzle game. Pretty fun game. Um, and then um, once you're done with that part of the game. And you think it's over. It's not over. There's more levels that you can do, which is a little bit harder this time around, <clears throat> because you're not um, you're not only rescuing the toys, but this time you have to lead the toys to the door to the exit. So um, yeah, that's for the next part of the game. But overall, I did enjoy it. <clears throat> it was a good game. Um, do I recommend this game? Um, the game is forty nine ninety nine. Um, it's a bit up there. I think if it was like if it was like maybe like thirty nine ninety nine, then it would definitely be worth getting. But fifty is a bit high. But I can see why they charge fifty for it. But <clears throat> you know, do I recommend this game? Um, if you never played the Mario vs Donkey Kong game, I recommend trying out the demo first. Try out the demo. And if you enjoyed the demo, if you want more out of the game, I say go for it. But 
if you didn't like the demo at all, and if you think this game is not for you, if you don't like puzzle games, then I wouldn't recommend it. But um, yeah, that's the end of this video. I do have another game review coming up shortly, so be on the lookout for that. Thank you so much for watching, and have a good day.